guys. Um, for today's video, I, okay. Firstly, the light is it, the light. There are like two lights in here only right now, and they're really what's giving off this entire bright effect. Not the sunlight that I normally use in some efforts. But yeah, for today's video, I'm tackling a question that a lot of people have wondered. Well, not really, but it's something that I thought would make sense to do, and that is, can you make or can you color decent artwork with wax, okay pause, wax crayons? Let's find out. So, firstly, what I think we need to start off with is making like a little mini swatch chart somewhere on the page. So I'm going to do that real quick and come back to you guys. Alright, so yeah, that's basically the, all the colors. And the others that are in this bag, I, I can see how they look already. There are some that were in the box though. Yeah, they're different. These are Crayola, so you know I'm all I'm all over Crayolas 24 7. I, I have faith that they do the same thing that they do with their pencil crayons with these. So yeah. Firstly, we're gonna try and test it out on just a simple ball. And I'm just gonna use it three colors okay it's an awkward color selection oh let's drop this one in uh get out yeah here we are these three colors olive green oh, uh, spring green and yellow or yellow green sorry where have you gone eyes but yeah now, okay, alright, I know I shouldn't really be testing it out here, which is a very bad idea, but all bad ideas start from your trials, but through your trials you become greater, so technically they're not that bad, if you know what I'm saying, so, yeah, I'm just, this is going to be the only one I do on screen as is, and I have two other tests that I'm going to carry out after this. So, yeah. But look at that, though. I wasn't even expecting it to look that well. I was expecting some really blotchy looking colors. But let me not go ahead. Being that my light source is actually right here, I guess it makes sense to have, you know. So yeah, and let's put in a little shadow, let's see if we can even get a proper shadow. I haven't used wax curves in like years, okay that's silver, wait what, silver? Okay, um, where is it, okay probably this one doesn't have a grey, this pad doesn't have a grey then. Let's go to rose art, I know right, you, you'll never hear me say that when it comes down to pencil crayons. All the rose art pencil crayons aren't like that bad. I'm just a biased Crayola fan, so I'm not going to support rose art that well. But you know what I'm saying. They're still good either way. That's just my opinion. My unbiased opinion. Well, it probably is very bad as well, yeah. So, yeah, that that turned out pretty well. Um, let me see how... Wow, on camera, this looks even better. Okay. Now, we've gotten that. Now, let's go on to this. Not that, but down here. And uh, I'm going to see if I can color this in and make it look somewhat decent. It's supposed to be glasses, but then I got lazy midway and stopped. Okay, pro let's see it's about four minutes or eight minutes it's not eight it's let's look all right it's four minutes yes it is four minutes so let's just do this one real quick on camera and the last one i do off camera yeah what color is this i just took up two random colors purple mountains majesty that's a lot of words in one color though damn all right 
that's not bad. Right, let's see if we can find something else to like apply a little shadows with. Um, need something that's in the purples, purple, purples, purple, and is somewhat cool as well. If I do have anything like that, I don't want to go away. You know what? I haven't tried it in my life, so I guess it's Pacific Blue. Okay, I'm wasting a lot of time right now. This is why you should always familiarize yourself with your equipment before. shadow because I'm not willing to find a next color right now. Uh, let's hope that all turns out well. Uh, I'm even coloring after the lines now. Okay, that's, that's a bad sign. It's probably because the video is getting long now. I know it. I know it's happening. I'm trying to prevent it. getting some blacks on that now and just to keep an even-ish blend I'm gonna use rose art black that way I'm not looking too biased because you know I naturally am all right sure if this last one will end up turning out that well. It'll probably look way better on camera though, so I guess that's a good sign. But either way though, it's just not gonna turn out that well. kind of decent now for the last one the last one I'm not gonna do that while you guys can easily see me doing everything but I'm still gonna use curl you're gonna see me while I'm doing it but it's just not gonna be in average timing and if you don't know who this is already it's supposed to be Urza from the anime fairy tale now ready go
All right, so yeah, guys, that's it. Um, were these horrible? Were they good? Were they tolerable? How did they look to you guys? I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna say. Okay, to me, some turned out better than others, and I also learned a lot from wax crayons because I learned that it's best to put on your lighter colors first and then build on your tones. Although back, although with some different materials, I'll always do that, but not with wax, not with crayons. I'm not used to doing that with crayons. I'll just normally start with the darker and then blend it through. But I learned that, that with the skin, if you should ever touch a part of the red right here, it will blend, it will pull that color around with it. And then you'll end up with a lot of messes right there. Um, aside from that, yeah, it was pretty decent. I really still like how this circle turned out. I'm shocked that it turned out that well. Um, the eyes look pretty decent and hair and probably his skin. I'm not sure how it looks on camera, but yeah. The glasses are meh. Um, but yeah, tell me what do you guys think of think of it in the comments. Does it look decent? Is it tolerable? Can you actually look at it for more than five seconds? My comment my comment section is now open to you guys. But anyways, that's all for now. Oh, and also, if you do hear music in this video, it's from Ben Sound, and it's royalty-free music that I found online, and he's allowing me to use the music as long as, you know, I just leave the... I just tell people that it's not mine, which I do in every video in the description down below. So, yeah, and... Yeah, that's it. That's all for now. Hope you guys have an awesome day, and later guys.